Well, for changes when it comes to nightlife in Boston, this following two violent attacks on women this year. And one of those cases was deadly. Our John Atwater is live outside police headquarters with the story. John. And Shannon, for the last several months, the city has been working with bar owners and they've developed this guide to help pe keep people safe when they're out at bars and clubs in the city. And as you mentioned, safety has really become a focus after some high profile kidnappings. Jassy Correa was killed after police say she was kidnapped outside a club in Boston. Police are now recommending security procedures involving proper surveillance inside and outside clubs and training for workers to identify customers who may be in trouble. Now, bar owners also say this process has opened the lines of communication with city regulators. I think people were under the misconception that calling the police and getting an incident report, which led to a violation hearing, auto automatically uh, meant you were going to be disciplined, and that's not the case. And instead of uh, facing violations every time there's an incident, now there's uh, much more of a spirit of cooperation. Well, of course, preventing crimes like this can be quite difficult, but bar owners do say that heightened awareness outlined specifically in this new guide can certainly help.